Dr. Lois DeFleur, president of Binghamton University, is a person who gets things done. President of our university since 1990, she has been the catalyst for major changes in our school, all for the better. She funded construction for over more than a dozen new buildings on campus and moved athletics to Division I from Division III, changing the school's mascot to the beloved Bearcat. Under her leadership, the university's endowment has swelled from 8 million to 64.5 million. The school's ranking has risen in numerous listings, and faculty research awards have increased 60%. On a more private note, she's a licensed pilot. And to me, that's an apt metaphor for her style. She's a high flyer who never loses sight of the individual buttons on the control panel and always keeps tuned to the traffic in the ear and on the ground. President de Fleur believes in nourishing and nurturing the university culture that's inclusive while celebrating the individuality of the many groups within the campus community. President de Fleur is a special friend of the Jewish community on campus, the Chabad Center in particular, and a personal friend as well. As there are many alumni and parents with us today, I want to publicly thank her for the outstanding sensitivity she has shown to the Jewish community over all the years, making sure that Jewish students can get home on time to be with their families for Rosh Hashanah, for Yom Kippur, and for the first days of Passover each and every year, and that commencement, the main festivities are never held on a Saturday or a Jewish holiday. For this, we thank you so much. We all hold our special thanks. President DeFleur will bring us greetings on behalf of the university. We thank President DeFleur for being here today and for giving us your remarks. Well, on behalf of the entire university, mazel tov. This is a great occasion. As I was thinking about today and this marvelous, marvelous facility, what I really, what really came home to me is that the bricks and the mortars, they're wonderful, but it does not really capture what Chabad means to this campus. It has been so important to our students in their support and in helping them uh, not only in academic ways, but in cultural and spiritual ways. And it has really enriched deeply the life at Binghamton University. And we are so proud because as Chabad has grown, so has the proportion of our student body who are Jewish of faith. And we now are among the top 20 proportionately in the nation in terms of our Jewish student body. I know that this would not have happened without the strong support that Chabad provides to our students. And just as I was talking to several of our alumni, they came from great distances to be here. And that is probably the most concrete testimony to how the activities here at Chabad have changed the lives of our Binghamton University students. I primarily want to thank Chabad for everything they do to so enrich this university and particularly Rabbi and Rizky Sloman. They are fantastic individuals and everything that Rizky said about focus, moving ahead, having a vision could be said many times over for both of them. So thank you. <laughs> this is a wonderful day, and I am very honored to be a part of it. Congratulations to everyone. <laughs>